Hi, I'm Leonard Burke with the Dunmore Bucks football team. Good morning, Pennsylvania! Lindgren checked out the local reaction at a Lackawanna County High School. Dunmore High School has published a school paper for 40 years without any incidents involving censorship. If there is a controversial issue, the issue is usually discussed with the advisor. And if the advisor feels that he should bring the administration in on a particular subject, he does. And then we discuss it openly there. But now principals like Charles Mecca have been given the authority to censor the school paper. According to the United States Supreme Court, a school need not tolerate student speech that is inconsistent with its basic educational mission, even though the government could not censor similar speech outside the school. But dissenting justices accuse the court of condoning thought control and argue that such unthinking contempt of individual rights is intolerable. Some students agree. This is, newspaper speech is supposed to be like your freedom to write, your freedom to express your ideas. And if the Supreme Court is going to you know, take away that right, then what goes the Constitution? The Supreme Court justices, however, feel that students' free speech rights are not violated by a school principal's censorship, as long as it's done in a reasonable manner. Penny Lindgren, News 22, with you in Dunmore. Still to come on News 20. Sports is next, and Dolphin great Mercury Morris stuff. Cross country this afternoon, Jim McAndrew, right here at Dunmore High School, set a new school record in a meet against Lakeland and Honesdale. McAndrew covered the course in a time of 15 minutes, 57 seconds, placing first in the meet and breaking the record of Jim Viola, which stood at 16.07. Pat Monahan of Honesdale placed second, and Ed Valinovich, also of Honesdale, was third. What it all means is Dunmore has virtually assured itself of the lead crown if they beat Abington Heights on Thursday. Meanwhile, in high school football, the Berwick Bulldogs in the second slot, followed by Riverside, Danville, and Dunmore. Six through ten, Kane trafficking.